Item number SCP-5508 Object Class Euclid Security Level 2 Special Containment Procedures The Parasonology Division will regulate and maintain two SCP-5508 colonies within Site-51's Eco-Containment Chamber 3. All maintenance will be performed by automated systems and unmanned rooms. Parasonology Task Force Delta-44 Critter Crushers is to monitor ant populations within the state of Arkansas for any uncontained SCP-5508 populations and destroy them. If any civilian contact has been made, records of the encounter are to be confiscated and amnestics administered to witnesses. Personnel without training and mental psionic defense are not to come into contact with uncontained SCP-5508 or SCP-5508-1 under any circumstances. In this situation, the unaffected individuals are authorized to employ long-range incendiary protocols on SCP-5508. Any SCP-5508-1 that survive are to be terminated on site. Description SCP-5508 is a mutation in southern meat and populations in which a colony will be capable of external psionic and physical manipulation. The colonies will use this manipulation for hunting organisms that they would otherwise be unable. An organism that comes within 3 meters of SCP-5508 will experience a drastic change in behavior and are designated as SCP-5508-1 instances. SCP-5508-1 instances will demonstrate a complete lack of self-preservation displaying desire to be eaten by nearby organisms. In humans, this effect will cause SCP-5508-1 instances to focalize their desire to be eaten. Prolonged exposure to this effect will lead to SCP-5508-1 instances partaking in self-consumption. SCP-5508-1 instances show the ability to survive severe blood loss and bodily change without expiring, typically living for days in terminal conditions. Whether SCP-5508 is a natural occurrence or a byproduct of outside manipulation is unknown. The location of known populations is well outside the natural habitat of southern meat ants indicating a high probability of some level of human involvement. Discovery On the year 2019, July 20th, a live video stream was uploaded to the video sharing platform YouTube depicting SCP-5508-1 affected individuals. The video was flagged internally, and assets within Google contacted the foundation. They provided the recording and GPS data associated with the upload. The individuals depicted in the video were confirmed to be Connor and Daniel Phillips of Newton, Arkansas. Video Log Begin Log Camera pans to Connor Phillips' face. Guys, you're not going to believe this! Camera angle changes showing a large field. Danny never came in for lunch, so come looking for him. I didn't get too close now, and I'm damn sure he was sitting out here poking his pecker. I kid you not. <laughs> We're gonna pay him a little visit. Connor begins walking through the field. Daniel Phillips comes into the field from behind. Daniel is sitting on the ground, looking between his legs. Both arms are moving rapidly. As Connor gets closer, a large anthill comes into view. Is he being there on an ant? Connor is now approximately five meters from Daniel and the anthill. He begins circling to the front of Daniel. Hey, Danny. What? What? What are you doing, Danny? Daniel's lower body is covered in ants. It has sustained severe damage, almost no tissue remaining on his calves and feet. Daniel is in the process of consuming his own intestines when Connor interrupts. But bro, you gotta try this. It's freaking delicious. Daniel reaches out with his intestine pulling out more from the tear in his abdomen. Jesus Christ, Danny! Snap out of it! I... I gotta go get help! No, you gotta have some! I'm telling you! Daniel takes a bite of his own intestine. It's great! 
Daniel tugs on his intestine, tearing his abdomen and fully disemboweling himself, gurgling his blood before vomiting. Zipping me, bro. There's plenty for us both. Frick, frick, frick. Connor begins running towards Daniel. Stopping two meters from him, Connor then appears to sit next to Daniel before dropping a camera on the ground. The image goes black. Daniel and Connor can be heard grunting over the sounds of it popping, gurgling, and chewing. This continues for three hours before the video was flagged and removed. End log. Responding agents recovered two SCP-5508 colonies on the Phillips residence, along with the skeletal remains of Daniel, Connor, and two squirrels near one of the SCP-5508 colonies. The concealment team responsible for SCP-5508 enacted cover story P-977, Accidental Death in Regards to Daniel and Connor Phillips. Personal records indicated the Phillips brothers purchased both SCP-5508 colonies as a means of pest control for their 15-acre wheat farm. The invoice relating to the purchase of SCP-5508 was labeled Pest Control, Pest Controlling Pests and signed by C. Larson. Handprint analysis confirms the signatory to be Craig Larson, a person of interest with known connections to para-entomology. Mr. Larson's connection lends to the probability of a paraentomology organization operating without a foundation's direct knowledge. The investigation is currently ongoing.